Hello there, this is the normal Admega 328 chip. Now you can see a small chip and this is a tiny 30 microcontroller, a very small low cost microcontroller. It has 8 pins and 1 kilobytes of memory. And in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to upload code to ATtiny30 using Arduino Uno. Let's get started this video. Now I am having an SMT version of ATtiny13. So first I'm going to make a breakout board for this. First I took dot board and male header pins. Then I inserted the male header pins into dot board and soldered them. Next I removed the excess dots of copper using thermocol cutter. Then I connected single standard copper wires to ATtiny and placed in the middle of dot board. And I connected each wire to corresponding header pins. I placed that in a breadboard. Next we need an Arduino Uno. Now let's connect VCC of ATtiny tiny to 5 volt pin of Arduino ground to ground pin 13 of Arduino to pin 7 pin 12 to pin 6 and pin 11 to pin 5 connect pin 10 to first pin of ATtiny. tiny Finally, attach a LED to pin 3 of ATtiny with a 1K resistor. That's all about hardware connection. Now open Arduino IDE and go to File, Preferences and paste microcore board URL there. Then click OK. Now go to Tools, Boards, Board Manager. Scroll down to last and install microcore. Now let's make our Arduino into an ISP programmer. For that open ISP example sketch. Select the correct board and communication port. Then click upload. That's it. Now our Arduino act like a ISP programmer. Now open your sketch that you wanted to upload in ATtiny. Here I am demonstrating with blink sketch. So I open the blink sketch. Then I change the LED pin to pin 4 because we connected the LED to pin 3 of ATtiny. That is the digital pin 4 of ATtiny. Now select board as micro core ATtiny 13. Choose the correct port. Next change the programmer to Arduino as ISP. This is very important. Now click on sketch and select upload using programmer or press ctrl plus shift plus u. Now you can see the code is uploaded and LED started to blink. Now we can remove all jumper wires except the power wires we can see everything is working perfectly so that's all about today hope you enjoyed and learned something from my video if so please like share and subscribe all up to you i will see you next time